Hey guys, I'm back and I might have the same shirt on, but I'm just filming videos back and you know, back and forth. Um, this is my update on my Miss Wigs, Miss O um unit from Miss Wigs and I have like some bad things about it. Um but mostly it's halfway it's like half and half i don't know how to feel about it but i just love how it looks my most complaint about this hair is that i had it for about two weeks now and the first week i mean like i did i flat ironed it on the first day i got it it didn't shed that much it was just normal shedding like a little few strands here and there but as the days went on it just started shedding more and more and more and more and Right now, it's shedding right now. Okay, just ran my fingers through the ends, and this is what I get from just that. And earlier, I brushed through it to flat iron it a little bit, got the full brush. This is just from running my fingers right through it. Like, you could just go like this, and it just come, here it goes, there it is. This comes out. I don't know if it's just this wig in particular that I got a bad wig or something like that. But another complaint is in the back. <clears throat> Or the webs are sewn to an elastic. One of my webs is hanging. I just haven't cut it. I just, just don't feel like doing it. It's hanging from, you know, it just it came off. Like, I don't know what happened. It's just, like, really? This wig was $50, basically. $49.50 $49, for a wig. I don't pay. Forty nine mm -hmm. to fifty dollars for a wig that is gonna shed. It's going to tracks are gonna fall out. Like, are you serious? This is not a quick weave. Okay, get your life together. The hairline is bottom. Right, this right now, this is realness. Okay, but when it comes to my hair and I'm at school and I'm going like this and it's never ending shedding all of my stuff I wear mostly black clothes because I just like the color black and I'm a cosmetologist so we have to wear we have to you know look professional why am I at school like this like ew hair all over all over the floor all over it's like caught up right now in my necklace right now it's like wrapped around it like because it just sheds so much now, I have a Vivica Fox wig that's, um, that's been flat ironed, that I, it was wavy, and I flat ironed it, like, yes, mm -hmm. a few days ago, I flat ironed it. I got it, um, a week before Christmas, and then I wore it curly all Christmas, and I wore it curly after Christmas, but I just flat ironed it, so, that hair, when I brushed it to get the curls out, it did not shed as much as this hair sheds. Maybe two of these. Two of these little hairs like this. Two of them compared to one one like one brush through. This is a finger comb shed. The brush, I have a pedal brush which is supposed to make your hair not it's not supposed to harm your hair that much. But if you have hair that's shedding, it doesn't shed from the top. It all sheds from the back and I'm gonna show you it did not look this thin okay this is how thin the ends are right now wait are you serious it was not this thin it was not looking like this it wasn't that way now I don't know if it's just that wig so I'm going to give them another try on a different wig so I can just see if not that it's that but my friend had a wig, a lace front, and that's how I heard about these wigs. I've heard about it on YouTube, but I also actually got to try one on. She had one, and I don't know, it was a Miss O, and it was short, it was about a 16 inch, and it was just wavy, like wavy, like cramped. So I tried her design, and I loved the hairline, so I said, you know what, I want to get me one of those. So I got this one because I love blonde hair and I just wanted a good lace bar that looked like it was just coming out of my hairline. So I got that and hers, it didn't shed a lot. It wasn't shedding like this. I don't know if it's just this one in particular or if it's just, you know, but what I have planned for this is to probably cut um, the ends of this so that it's like an 18 inch 
and then I'm going to get a, one bundle of um, master mix hair from the beauty supply store in this color and kind of just fill in where it looks real thin at because I don't want to walk around looking like the cool argue with these thin ends like that's like really important to me is like how it looks in the ends like the ends if your hair looks thin pants it looks like your hair has just been bleached like I don't want people to be like oh that's a wig like no this looks really real and a lot of people thought that this is actually my real hair when I first had it but now it just looks like a wig and it's just uh and the track is hanging in the back and I can't you can't see it but it's like it's there like I see it hanging I was so mad about that like really a fifty dollar wig I shouldn't have to man repair put web ceiling on a, a wig that costs fifty dollars that should be professional enough that you know it shouldn't shed like that like I know everything sheds but if it's shedding like a twenty dollar wig then you know what you need to get your life together Miss Wig but I'm gonna give you one more chance nothing better go wrong and I contacted the company and I asked them like what are they gonna do about it so they said they would get back in contact with me and let me know what was gonna happen because you know what fifty dollars is not cheap like you can get a pair of shoes for fifty dollars you can get you know you can get a good lace front that won't shed for fifty dollars you can even get like your nails done you can get your toes done you can get anything like you can get stuff for fifty dollars then rather buy a wig that's gonna shed every day and get thinner and thinner and thinner and thinner and then you look like who are you like look at this I'm literally just pulling the hair out it just comes look at that are you serious no like I haven't worn this wig in so in like a week because I don't want to be at school pulling my hair out with my fingers this is my fingers I'm not even brushing it if I brush it even more it'll come out it's all over me. It's really, seriously, this sheds like some hair that I get off of a website or online that just sheds. No. Like, no. I got a wig and it was about over. It was $15. It was just a full wig. I got it at the Beauty Spy store. It was my first blonde wig that I ever bought and not made. And it had a little top circle that had a little skin top and it was like it was synthetic it was fifteen dollars so that wig kind of shed like this but this one was fifty dollars and that one was twenty basically fifteen dollars to fifty like who are you miss wigs i just want to know why my wig is shedding like a dog okay but anyways um that's pretty much my thoughts about this wig like i will give them another try the top looks nice. It looks nice from up here. Like it looks real nice. But when you get down to here, no, no. And when it's down to the back of my hair, it just looks like see-through ends. Like this is what you get. This is both ends put together. Who wants that? Like right? no. Anyways, that's my thoughts about this wig. And yeah, if I do come, if I do. Um, decide to make a video about what I did to kind of fix this problem I will make a video about it and let you know what I did and if you do get a wig like that you can fix the wig so that's really it and um yeah the next wig I get from them is a little bit more curlier it's like loose it's like more spiral curls but it's like straight up here and it kind of goes into these spiral curls so we'll see that one next and i have another wig review coming up from another hair company so i will be back and i will be putting out my videos because i have like four videos that i need to put out and i'm gonna put them all out at the same time basically or i'll put like three out i have one video from the summer that i forgot about but anyways don't mind if, if i say it's the sun but until my next hairstyle i'll see you